what was so refreshing about the way he wrote this this novel was his his absolute candid honesty about every every tumultuous you know radical endeavor that he that he went through and and he held nothing back he pulled no punches and i think w whenever you're presented with a, an opportunity to do a movie you look for that kind of honesty in a lead character and a storyline and um, he was unapologetic about his his actions and and about his lust for wealth and his lust for consuming everything around him and that's just a basis for for a great character and a great story and also of course you know the fact that he ultimately had to pay the price is is really something that makes for a great movie originally we got the screenplay um, uh, and uh, you know I, I just fell in love with this character I really wanted to do this movie and and um, Scorsese was very much interested in doing the project. You know, we had just finished Shutter Island. We were trying to set the film up, but the financing fell through. And um, it, he went on to go do another project and was about to do another one. And I was trying to move on with another director, but I just couldn't get, uh, you know, Scorsese out of my mind for this material because there's something you know, that we've seen in his work, wherein he's, he's able to bring out a life in these characters, a reality, and, and a sense of humor to that dark side, which is so apparent in this movie, which very, very few filmmakers can accomplish. So I couldn't get him doing this specific material out of my mind. And, uh, you know, Terry Winter's script had so much humor in it. And in a lot of ways, I remember him telling me about Goodfellas being, you know, almost uh, a dark comedy you know that was his original tent with that film and this uh, lent itself to that you know that style of filmmaking so I reapproached him and I said look you know we have these great partners in, in Red Granite with uh, Joey and Reza who are not only financiers but collaborators and they uh, essentially you know they want to give us free reign to explore that dark side and and um, not do a sort of G-rated version of this movie, and they want to, you know, give us the budget to sort of uh, show the epic expanse of this world in the 90s in, in, in America. And this is w one of those rare times in, in, in our careers where we're going to be able to do what we want. And, and I'd encourage you, you know, to try to um, take another shot at looking at this. And so he did, and, and luckily we got to make the movie. And it is one of those rare experiences where, um, you know, uh, and, uh, and the artists get really free creative control of what they did, and that was the attitude of making this movie. And uh, I wish more movies were like that.